Good afternoon, everyone. My name is Councilwoman Betty Guardado from District 5 in the city of Phoenix, and we're doing our first neighborhood news. So hopefully you'll stay tuned and watch it all. And we are here today at our neighborhood cleanup at 19 North. We have a couple of guests, but today I want to introduce my first guest, Representative Raquel Teran. Hi, Councilwoman. Congratulations Thank on your you. first 100 days. I know, right? It seems like it was just yesterday we won. And our district overlap. I, it does. I really want to hear about what you have accomplished in the first 100 days. Wow, where do we start? It feels like a year. So we did a district, we did a tour throughout the district where we wanted to make sure that we brought all of the department heads from the city of Phoenix, including the mayor. And we went from 19 North to Villa de Paz and we ended at Maryvale and we had our constituents, over a hundred people, talk about what are some of the needs, what are some of the issues that we have throughout the district and it went amazing. People felt heard. It was great and thank you so much for joining us on that. I was happy to be there. And our accelerated maintenance program, which means that we are fixing our roads here in the city of Phoenix. And we've done 20 miles already wow. in District 5, which is amazing. So we have, we're part of that. We, have all, we also did a water drive in the district where we work together with MRC, with UFCW Local 99, with our Cartwright School District, and we distributed water throughout the district. We distributed over 100 cases in less than a month, which was amazing. And then we also saved the light rail. We were able to get close to 70% of people that live in District 5 to vote to keep the light rail and to keep expanding. So it's been, a, it's been amazing, it's been great. I'm throughout the district and I just want to thank you so much for being out here today. Wow, you've done so much in just 100 days. Yes, I think I'm driving my staff crazy because we've done more in three months for District 5 than what's been done in the last year. It's been amazing. Congratulations, Councilwoman. Thank you. It's wow. been amazing. Wow, and who's helping you in the district? What did you bring on to your team? Well, I have an amazing staff. Andrew Wonder is my chief of staff. Right, he is a political director and he's been he's been amazing in terms of guiding me on what needs to be done for the district. Our community constituents person, Emmanuel Gallardo, um, he has 10 years of experience and we have Michael Angulo, who's our director analyst in terms of doing our, our research for the office. So it's been amazing. Nice job. Thank you so much, Councilwoman, for everything you do for our community. Now, thank you for being here with us today. Please don't go away. We have our second guest that we're gonna be introducing and it's Shannon McBride. She is the leader at 19 North. And I want you to hear her story. I want you to, I want you to hear her talk about the amazing work and the leadership that she's provided for 19 North. Thank you. So let's just take a moment to think about why is it that we're here today, right? We're just not here to clean up because it's something that we have to do and it's the right thing to do. Sure, is it the right thing to do? Absolutely. But we take pride in the community that we live in and keeping it clean, it's also gonna keep it safe, right? As we see our beautiful light rail that we were able to save a few weeks ago and we, right, which was amazing. And now we have all these great businesses that are coming into, into this part of town. We're revitalizing Chris Town Mall. Like, but in order for us to keep these businesses coming into our community, they gotta feel that they're safe. Right? We're creating good jobs, we're creating a good community, and if we keep it clean, people are gonna be happy and people are gonna wanna move here and people are gonna be, wanna be part of us. Right? So thank you so much. Well, welcome back everyone. And now I want to introduce to you guys my second guest. And she is a key leader in this community. God wish that I could clone her and put her throughout District 5. And I want to introduce to you guys Shannon my bride from 19 North. So what are we doing here today, Shannon? Hi, I'm so glad you guys are here. It makes me happy to work with you. Um, so today was a street cleanup. So we've got Brophy Prep and Community Medical Services and your office. And we're up and down 19th Avenue just picking up trash and making our community safer. Right, you are just that energizer bunny that just keeps going. I do. So tell us, 
What else is going on? What else do you have going on in 19 North? So 19 North is the name of the area that goes from Montebello to Dunlap, 15th to 23rd Avenue. And we've got lots of things going on. The, the mission is every business thrives, every student succeeds, and every neighborhood is safe. So community event coming up is uh, September 26th. We've got a community bowling night. Your um, organization has a lane, That's right? right? Your office yes. does, great. Every lane, 48 lanes, have different neighborhoods and business groups and just all playing together and, and hanging out together. So that's September 26th. So how can people get involved? I would. Everyone should get yeah. involved. How do they get involved? And I want everybody involved. This is what it's all about. So our website is 19north.org. My email is info at 19north.org. And I would love to have anybody come and join us. Perfect. Well, as you guys heard, we are going to be here every month and come and look at our news. See what's going on in District 5. Get involved and come with us. And thank you for joining. Thank you.